Hi everyone! Welcome back to my channel. It's Delvani. So today's video is going to be a room tour. I'm back with the content, the college content is coming up or whatever. I'm wearing my Cornell hat. Over. Over. <laughs> okay, so yeah, I'm gonna show y'all my room. Um, mm, I'm so excited. Okay. So I just put up some posters today and yeah i just bought this hat today too and i was like i've been wearing for this video it's so cute it's so cute uh, this is my door and then when you turn around i live in a double by the way um when you turn around this is what you see this is my roommate's side this her name is angelina this is my side of the room so when you walk in you automatically go here i'm gonna start with the closet when you open up the closet, you see everything that's in here. Um, there was nothing on the door. I bought these command strips because when I stayed here over the summer, that door had had hooks. And so I just felt like, why shouldn't I have hooks? Anyway, yeah, I put my bags here, my tote bags. This is my towel, my face towel, and my um, robe. These are my handbags down here. Um, down there are my laundry things. Here is where I put the shoes that I wear the most. And then some other shoes. And then like some boots in the back also. And then here I have my jackets. And sometimes I plan out outfits beforehand and just put them there. My two gray hoodies and my robe. My cute robe. I have a throw blanket up here for when it gets cold. It's 90 degrees today, so I don't really need a throw blanket right now. My neck pillow, some other towels I have, some other thick long sleeve shirts that I just can't fit in my drawer that I'm going to show y'all later. Another hat. This is my student government hat when I ran for student government. This is what I use. This Cornell bag that I got. Um, a lot of hangers because I bought a whole lot of hangers and I didn't even realize I did. Like, I just have a lot of hangers. Um, yeah. So, I got this. Well, my best friend got it for me from, I think, five and below. These I got from Deals and Discounts. Um, Command Hook. I got it from the Cornell store. Um, yeah. So, you just close the main closet door. And then we get to the utility cart. Honestly, I did not really need this um, for right now. I feel like it's going to become more useful later on. But for right now, I just put my shower caddy. I take this in the shower with me every day. Um, and then I have this plastic thingy so that uh, the wet shower caddy won't rust up my utility cart. I have some lotion here, some clarifying toner pads. And on this aisle right here, I have some more body stuff. I have my long brush when I have to feel like I have to exfoliate. Nair, baby powder, oil, tin skin, oil, hairspray. Hairspray doesn't really belong here, but I was using hairspray when I was, when my braids were fresh. I loved using hairspray, like, I love it. And then down here, I have my mini vacuum, the vacuum heads, and some trash bags. I got this utility cart from Bed Bath & Beyond. Um... Ikea has some, but yeah. So and then we get to the dresser. I have this mirror right here. Um, I had it from Target. It's super, super cute. It's like this really gray color. It's really nice. And then I have my bigger mirror right here that I am so happy I bought because the other mirror over here has barely any light. It's not even funny. Like, I can't even see over there. But, yeah, I got this from Amazon. Um, if I remember, I'll link it down below. If I remember, y'all, yeah, don't, don't, don't question me. I don't know. It's pretty big. It's actually huge. Um, but I didn't want, like, the full one. I, I wanted this one. It's really cute. Five, five, two. That's 12 bulbs. That's 12 bulb one. So, next, I have this acrylic makeup container. I had it from, like, eBay, but... There's the same one on Amazon. I just found it on eBay for cheaper. It's the same exact thing. Like, 
They all got it from the same wholesaler, so I was like, I'm going to buy the cheaper one on eBay. And I got this one from Amazon, this jewelry organizer. I got these acrylic things from Deals and Discount, and then some more things from Deals and Discount. And then I got this from Deals and Discount also, these little things that's similar to my shoe holder thingy. <laughs> I have my lashes, my palettes, some pills, rubber bands for my braces. Vaseline, sunscreen, I wear this every day, acne medication, um, yeah, and then I have this, my little ring light, when I can't see, y'all, I feel like I cannot see nothing, I need so much light in order to, like, fully get ready, because I need to see, but I have this little Glade thing I plug in sometimes, because I want it to really smell nice and new and clean and fresh, and then I have this little light right here, but the only reason, I, I don't even need it for real, um, Cornell gave us our own light, but I like this because it has some things that I could plug into, so I plug in my light because I don't have a box for it, so I just plug it into my light. And when I'm doing my nails, this is really, really helpful, so, um, yeah. And then we move on to here. This is just where my majority of my stuff is. Um, I got this from Dollar Tree. These two from Dollar Tree, and inside, I just have my everyday things. So, I have some... Fluconazole, some acetophilus, however the fuck. These are all for like vagina health or whatever. Um, this baggy, and then I have some cotton swabs, micellar water, cotton pads. Um, this is what I. This, yeah, or the 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 regular blue Dove one. Um, the Dove Original. I either use Dove Original or Dove uh, Sensitive Skin for, you know, your vulva, yeah. You cannot be using, like, I have this big one right here. But this is the Sensitive Skin one, but it has fragrance. And I'm sorry, like, I'll buy a whole another bar of soap um, for my vulva. Thank you. <laughs> In here, I just have a bunch of COVID tests, um, some snacks, some photo, a photo frame, and just a couple of extra stuff in there. I don't know. And then I have my hats, um, some like calendar and some like like prayers and promise for women. It has some really nice Bible verses in there um, for inspiration. This is my uh, creation, creator little baggie where I have all my technology in there. I usually put it in my bag because I don't know when I'm going to be in the mood to edit. Um, this um brita filter container too because to take out food from cornell's dining you need to buy one of those um i bought it over the summer so it's just chilling here whenever i feel like i want to take things home but most of the times i have dinner lunch or breakfast in the dining hall with my friends so but sometimes if i'm feeling really really anti-social i'll take it to my dorm and how it is like you bring it in the dirty one and then they give you a new one so Thank you. Febreze Edge Control, my favorite perfumes. These are my favorite perfumes to use. This is the Versace Bright Crystal Absolute, the pink one. And then the Nest one. Both of these I got from Sephora. There's, this one smells so good, y'all. Like, I might just get the full size one. It smells so freaking good. So flowery, so nice. And like, ugh. I got some scent, scent bird perfumes. I have some photo collages of me and my best friend. This was on my 17th. This is on my 18th. This right here is prom. So, love her so much. Love you, Erin Allah. <laughs> and then I have some other perfumes. My mom's fancy deodorant she gave me. Because I started getting boils underneath my armpit. But it was because I was using the powder deodorant. I switched to gel and that stopped. So, try switching to gel if you're getting boils underneath your armpit. My mom, she gave me like the fancy one, right? But at the same time, girl, I need something strong. The gel one, thank you. And my Alexa, she doesn't work because I don't know how to add it to Cornell's network. So she's just a Bluetooth speaker at this point. Like, I can't. And it's flashing purple because it's not connected to the Wi Fi. It's not supposed to be flashing anything. Some more water bottles I got for free. Um, and then we go up here. I have this gray coat that I got from my Roar Club before I left. Start each day with a grateful heart. Gratitude is one of the most important things you can practice in your everyday lives, y'all. Like, it's completely changed my life. Um, there's always something you can be grateful about. Always something you can be grateful about. And in order to manifest efficiently, you have to be grateful for what you have right now. So, sit down, think about it, journal. I'm telling y'all, it did change my life. 
I have this calendar board from, I got it from my graduation part, my going away party, yes. From Jessica, thank you so much. I just put some quotes on there. Your grades don't define you, journal as much as possible, and nothing changes if nothing changes. Yeah, that last one, nothing changes if nothing changes, y'all. Like, you cannot expect to be a straight A student and you, you, you don't go to office hours, you don't do nothing. Like, if you're a B student, you just expect it to just become an A student if you didn't change your habits. Nothing changes if nothing changes, y'all. And then I got this from like literally like my corner store. They just had a bunch of these. They're fake. And so I just like put it there. Oh, how did I miss this poster? This is an Ophelia poster. I got it today at the Cornell store along with some other posters. Ophelia poster is one of my fave. Um, it's the movie Melancholia. Melancholia. Um, did a scene that was very similar to Ophelia. This was when, you know, she was t completely heartbroken. Hamlet, her brother, her dad, everybody was just disappointed. All the men in her life was just disappointing her. And so I think she basically, well, it's alluded that she basically killed herself. And she's just in a river, sad as fuck. And, you know, I feel like that's so inspirational to just, girl, if you don't do it yourself, you're going to end up just like this. All right? All right. <laughs> she's just a victim to the patriarchy and that's what i see this poster as so it's really nice reminder to just this is good what could happen y'all get your money up not your funny up thank you yeah i just really love that poster i didn't know where to put it because it didn't really go in the aesthetic over there but i just thought i just love seeing this poster right here look at her she's just sad sad as fuck don't be like Ophelia. Okay, so we're moving on to the bed part. Yeah, this is the best I can make my bed. I'm not gonna lie. I don't be making my bed. Um, this is this is as good as it's gonna get, y'all. Um so my roommate, she just does her bed every day. It looks mad good every day. She has like a really cute plushies over there, but anyway. So there's poop on my window, obviously. And her windows, they're just poop. Like I walked in, moved in. And there was just poop here. I don't know. I usually have these blinds down, so I don't really notice the poop. But yeah, <laughs> let's just ignore that. But I have some paintings that I drew um, from Paint and Sip at the SU events. My journal, I journal every day. I just started back up again after not journaling for about a month. And I could feel the effects on me. I'm just so much more peaceful when I journal, y'all. It's not even funny. Some books over here on how to be a better student. Um... Some more flowers that I got from the deals and discount store. I just got this poster today. This poster today. And then I got this one from Bed Bath & Beyond. I got my sheets. I'm not going to lie. Without this, this looks like a man's bed. This looks like a man's bed. Because I thought gray was going to give. But it gives manly. I'm ugh, I'm like kind of tight about it. But it's fine. And it came with one pillowcase. So I had to take the pillowcase from another. But Yeah. And then I have this Drexel University little thing. I won their pitch competition over the summer, to, last summer. And so I got that as one of the prizes. So, girl, it's sticking here. And then I got this little pillow from Jenny. It's so cute. But I have yet. I'm, like, scared to wash this. And, you know, I got this, like, a month ago. And... I don't know throughout shipping it it was in a warehouse this does not need to be anywhere near my face so that's why it's at the end of my bed like and i'm scared to wash it because i feel like it's gonna get matted up but anyway i don't know yeah it was in a shipping warehouse it was in the hands of people i don't need to, this to be anywhere near my face but and then i got my trash can over here all of my suitcases and then we get under here this is my hair bin i have blow dryer blow dryer crimper straightener a smaller straightener brushes curler just a lot a bunch of hot tools um for when i start wigs again and then here is just my hair stuff so here is just like wig caps hot hot wig wax sticks um just a bunch of goodies that i usually get in a in a like a wig box so this is just also some hairpins and um, clips. Just a bunch of like hair stuff in here. Some, yeah. 
Um, and in here are my two favorite wigs. They're my two glueless wigs that I love and cherish so much. I'm waiting to bust out when it's getting cold. Um, I have just a bunch of hair stuff. This is my my nail little thing. It doesn't want to close because it's filled to the mask. But um, I have just some a lot of hair stuff. A lot of hair stuff. Um, yeah. Just a lot of products. Push that back here. And then another suitcase. Just I have a lot of suitcases. Um, I didn't rise up my bed too much because I want to be able to get on my bed freely. Thank you. So this is my fridge. Um, I got this fridge because I, I like making sandwiches. So if Angelina were ever to get a fridge, I'm going to have to like push it to the side. But thank gosh, she doesn't have one. So mine could just stick in the middle. But So this is like my fridge. Some bread. <sighs> Some bread. Some cheese, some croissants, just like ingredients to make a sandwich, jalapenos, just literally ingredients to make a sandwich. My freezer is empty. And then I have a microwave. It comes, it's called a micro fridge. Like you go to www.microfridge.com and then you can see your school is on the list of the places they ship to. And when you walk into your dorm, it's already there. Like, you don't have to carry this yourself. You just walk in and it's already there. So, yeah, it comes together like this can't move. Like, this is, like, bolted together. Um, yeah. I think I've covered everything, yeah. This was a really, really fast room tour. I don't know. But this is what it looks like. I just finished it up today. LOL. Oh, the poster's on the wall. Let me just say what, I, what it means to me, actually. I got this world poster, one, because it matches the aesthetic, but most importantly, two, because I kind of want to focus my education on, like, international studies. I'm going to end... Oh. I forgot to say! Okay, so I am studying industrial and labor relations. I'm in the ILR school. It is the study of work. Why you work, the laws behind working, the future of work... And what I want to pursue is HR, human resources, or consulting. Something like that in the business field where the money resides. Thank you. <laughs> so, but at the same time, like, I really want to base my education worldwide. Like, I want to learn another language, travel around the world, study abroad. I want to do all of that stuff with my ILR education. Um, yeah, and then I have just, like, a black woman little poster, which matched the aesthetic. Um, I, as a black woman, love it a lot. So... Yeah, um, I think that's actually it for real. Oh, the drawers. <laughs> Drawer number one. I have all of my t-shirts. This is a short, long sleeve, long sleeve, two-piece tank tops. So, this drawer, I have denim shorts, um leggings leggings dresses and sweatshirts and then lastly if i can open this up oh opened it okay i just have pants and skirts so these are my big mom jeans these are just my skinny jeans a random shirt and some skirts over here in the corner Sure, I have my home clothes, so a lot of t-shirts where my t-shirts reside, and my bonnet and stuff. And then in this drawer, I have pads, um, wipes, iron, more wipes, Dawn soap, um, utensils, more pads. Um, and then finally, oh, child, I am out of breath. Finally, in this drawer, it came broken. I have to like, I don't even know what I'm gonna do. I think I'm gonna tape it back. Cause previously people try to take this shit back, huh? I could see that. Um, yeah, I just have my old laptop in here, some pads and some stickers and just some random stuff. So, yeah, let me give a second look to see if I talked about everything. Um, I did. Okay. This is just the final look. Super, super cute. 
her stuff is super cute as well okay I want to thank you guys so much for watching this video give this video a thumbs up don't forget to like comment share and subscribe and stay tuned for some more Cornell content or just comment down what you want me to talk about with Cornell like Please don't ask me to make a stats video, y'all. I just, I don't want to do it. I, I'm not going to lie. I don't want to. I filmed it one time and I hated how it came out because I just like, it's a lot of talking, y'all. It's a lot of talking. And I just felt like I had a lot to say, but I didn't have the energy to say it. So I just hate filming a stats video. Anyway. So yeah, comment down anything else you want me to share with y'all. Um... Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I love y'all so much and I'll see you next time. Bye.